all I'm gonna say is that I just got home from work. <laughs> I just got home. Uh, I don't know. There used to be a shift after the one I just worked. Like it used to start at like 9.30. Well, that's what time I used to go. But they took that shift away. Now, if you have us there till after 10 o'clock, don't you need that shift? What do I know? All I know is that once I get my dental hygiene light, you know what? Let me stop. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Good morning. Um, I'm in a weird mood today. Not a good mood. It's Wednesday, but I should be in a good mood. I love Wednesday, but um, I'm not. I haven't been in a great good mood since yesterday. So, just gonna get through today. Hope that this goes away. But that's what I'm feeling. See you guys later. Hi. Class is over. <laughs> I, I'm still in a bad mood. I need a minute. Um, it was weird though because it got better during class. You know what I think it is? I did really bad on my test. I think I mentioned that. And before anatomy, like I was not feeling great. But then like in anatomy, I think it like started making sense and everything like that. So I felt better. But then like after class ended, I think it came back. So yeah fingers toes eyeballs crossed that they say do you not want to go to work today you know i always have a plan child um <laughs> i don't know what the plan will work out but i got all types of plans to like you know get out of this funk it's weird see y'all later good morning i am on my way to school i don't feel great still feeling like emotionally not great i think i feel better which is good been like uh going in waves you know it's like, it'll, I'll feel bad, then I'll feel good, blah, blah, blah. I'm excited because today is the day we um, get our loops. I'm not excited because I need to catch up on a ton of um, evals and stuff for me out sick. So, not a fan of that. But I know it'll be fine. I mean, I know that I can't be the first person who's missed a week of class. I know I can't be the first person who's done poorly on their first test. And the good thing about anatomy is that tests weekly are not cumulative the final is cumulative but um it's nice that i can kind of just focus on the new material get that down master that and then of course make sure that i'm peppering in the first week stuff but you know it's not like i'm automatically gonna or it's not like i have a high chance to do poorly on the second test you know because it's, it's the uh, same material as the first one anyway the last thing i want to do is come here every day and be like eh, i'm in a bad mood eh, i'm in a bad mood um, so Hi, welcome to the rest of today. I feel a lot better today. I don't know if maybe, I, you know, I probably need to be around people in like a social way. Cause of course I've been, well, maybe not of course, but I went to the warehouse uh, the last three days, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, but I don't really talk to my coworkers at the warehouse. So maybe I just need to be like around people and like social, um, you know, being an introvert, being isolated for COVID is like, I don't care. <laughs> Not really. Like I can stay at home for five, six days. That's fine. But maybe it's like, there's one thing of like literally staying in your house. And there's another thing of like going out, but maybe not like interacting with people, you know? So I did leave twice. I left once to go to get my medicine. And then I left another time to go grab a pickup order because the delivery order I got, they didn't bring everything that I ordered. So I had to do that. But other than that, I mean, I was like legitimately inside my house. So maybe that's why, I don't know, but I feel like a lot better. Um, we've been studying like histological uh, slides, I guess is the right way to say it. I've never like been able to identify a histological slide. Like I don't, I'm not even gonna say it looks like Greek to me because at least Greek is like a language. Like look, <laughs> looking at histological slides, I'm like, Whoa. you know, I'm, I don't understand it at all. So yeah, but uh, let's see, what should we catch up on? So being that I was out all last week, I missed eight hours of lab, which is 
devastating. But I talked to my instructor today and we're going to be setting tomorrow, the four hours of lab tomorrow, to practice vital signs, blood pressure, uh, practice my patient operator positioning, and the plan is to do my evaluations on Thursday of next week, so in a week from today, unless something goes wrong and you know I wanna extend it to Friday, but I really just wanna get at least a couple more times to take a blood pressure and see if I can actually get a reading that's within, I think it's like five mm. I don't know exactly the, the unit of measurements, but it's like five mm. I'll put it on the screen. So I have to make sure that I'm within that you know number. Today we did, um, we actually started exploring, so just using the instrument to see what calculus is present, et cetera, so on and so forth. We practice that on a, on a sim head, so like a, a fake head. But tomorrow, if you can imagine, we are going to be putting our hands and our instruments in another person's mouth. Now we're not going subjunctively, but we are still putting instruments in another person's mouth. So <sighs> these gums gonna be poked, unfortunately, I'm sure, and I'm gonna be poking people's gums. Oh my gosh, I forgot to say, we, we lost another student today. We now have 22 people. We started with 24. So we have two spots for people who, you know, could be in the program, but they're not. Um, I'm thinking about getting an iPad. These people at school are making me think that it would be helpful. I don't know if it really would, but that's, <laughs> that's what I'm thinking. So this one girl, she has one that's, um, really new I guess and it's really cool it has like double screen it's like you can record a voice while somebody's talking it's pretty cool but um she said it's really expensive I'm definitely not if I do buy an iPad I'm definitely not spending more than like 300 bucks on one it's just not happening and I don't know if I can get a 300 dollars iPad that does the stuff that hers is doing so yep that's all on my way home fingers crossed I get a text saying don't come to work but um I don't think I will because that's just the way my life is going lately. So we'll see what happens. Hi, just got home from school. There's a couple things I forgot to mention. I didn't get my loops yesterday. Also, <laughs> I did get this toothbrush yesterday. I haven't used it yet, but um, yeah. It's got like, um, should we do an unboxing? Ooh. So it's, um, hello. I'm supposed to use it for four weeks and then, then I'll know about the toothbrush so that way I can recommend it to my patients. Exactly. I'm a salesperson. We love, like, uh, pretty fancy to be honest with you. I don't really know how to use it. I, w I was absent the day that the rep came and gave like the demonstration, but apparently we have another rep coming for, I'm not, I'm not impressed with the way you had to turn that off. I'm gonna tell you right now. And then it comes with two heads, they're the same. They just say oral B I O. I guess the toothbrush itself has like different sensitivity settings. Oh, I'm lying. They're not the same brush. Ah! One of them is a gentle care brush and one of them is a ultimate clean brush. This one is the ultimate clean with a little white. This one is the gentle care, so. I'll probably start using the ultimate clean with the sensitive, whatever, I don't know. And then it has a, of course it has an app child. It's an app for that. And then it has, I like that the charger is like not open. I used to have a, I think it was Oral-B toothbrush and the charger had like a post on it. If you just put it like that or, <gasps> I dropped it. Wow, you cannot give me nothing. Oh, that's cool easier to clean it's like almost flat <gasps> and then i'm guessing a carrying case now is that a carrying case do they want you to take two brushes with you i'm confused they intend you to take two brushes i guess that makes sense right give you the room for two i don't know don't love that it's um like there's only, what, two little air holes? Toothbrush, 
she needs to be more air holes. Otherwise, you can't really, it's gonna go sour. But, okay. Bye. Well, finally happened. <laughs> it finally happened. Let me show you. Let me show you what happened. whole thing i have no i have no excuse <laughs> these fucking i'm gonna tell you my excuse these kids at school these youngsters <laughs> they're like the ipad is so cool it's so like this one girl she got her ipad after we started school and she's like yeah it's so good it's so much like it's so much better so much easier i i'm doing a payment plan for my loops i wanted to check in on friday and i totally forgot um, so I, I wanted to pay for my loops just straight up, up front, full, full, you know, $1,600, $1,700, whatever it was, but it turned out my card didn't have, like, the limit, it didn't have, the limit was too low to put the whole cost on there. So, long story short, the loops are on a payment plan, and I just kind of figured, since we're paying for the loops over, I think it's nine months, 12 months, that's how I justified this. But really, I didn't need no justification. Um, I'm gonna, you know, open it up and see what's going on. Cause like the last time I've owned an Apple product and actually like used it, probably 2008. So like 15 years ago, I had a MacBook. And since then it's been all PC computer. I've never had a, an iPhone. I do feel on an iPhone. And funny enough, if I didn't have this iPhone, I probably wouldn't have a YouTube channel because kind of like filming on my actual phone that I use like that's crazy to me <laughs> like this is an iPhone but it's like a camera you know I don't I don't go on the internet on it I don't have like go on apps I, I just use it to film my videos and I got it through this random not a focus group but kind of like a focus group where they sent me this iPhone I think I did a bunch of like uh, Siri prompts like over the course of a couple months or something and I got paid like, I don't know, 50 bucks at the end of it and I got an iPhone. So yeah, that's how that worked. But yeah, I don't, I don't know, like, like I'm not an iPhone person or an Apple person, but I now I have an iPad, so that's that. And I, I don't know why I mentioned it, but I brought a printer, which I probably should just take back. Um, it was 60 bucks, which not super duper expensive, but I mean, if I can just do the, homework on my iPad I don't need a printer like the only reason I got the printer was because to print out homework because it was so difficult to do on a computer and sometimes like when I got COVID I needed to print stuff and I like couldn't leave the house I couldn't go to the library I couldn't go to campus and I like didn't have a way to print you know but I don't need to print and if I do need to print something random we can print on campus for free and then at the library so yeah okay